What's up, guys? It's Josh from EverydayFBA.com. And over the weekend, I got approved for over 75 different brands in my Amazon account. Uh, super excited, super pumped for that because it really does open up an entire new world of inventory to you that you did not have access to before. So super awesome. Big brands, man. Nike, Reebok, Adidas, uh, Gucci, so on and so forth. Just a bunch of really big brand names. Uh, and I can continue to get approved for different ones as I come across a um, item that I am gated in. I'll apply for it and instantly I'll get auto approved. So it's pretty freaking awesome. Now, of course, I posted it to Instagram and I got a bunch of questions about it, what the process was, how did I do it, and I'm going to show you guys that right here, right now in this video. Now, if you guys are checking out this video looking for that secret sauce to get ungated in Nike, I'm here to tell you that it does not exist. Um, you're not just going to get auto approved in Nike if you've been selling on Amazon for two weeks or three weeks or even two months. Uh, you need to have an established history. You need to have a certain amount of sales and you need to have proven yourself as a reliable seller. And doing that, you'll get ungated in a lot of different brands. This video is going to go through the process of how to find a brand, put it into Sell Essential, see if you're restricted on it, and then apply for it and see if you get auto approved. Uh, this is the workflow that I use. Uh, you know, I went on this weekend for about two or three hours and just ran through brand after brand after brand after brand and got auto approved in all of them. So I hope it helps answer some of the questions that you guys gave me over on Instagram. If you're not following me on Instagram, uh, hit me up at Everyday FBA and uh, enjoy the video, man. Let me know if you guys have any questions. All right, guys, let's dive in here. This is your managed inventory page. Uh, you can really just do any page you want, but go under inventory and go under add a product. And then you'll come to this page right here with this little search box. Uh, and really just put in any kind of brand that you like. So if you want to do, for instance, you know, Star Wars, uh, which is a big gated brand, you can try that. And it's going to come up with a bunch of different um, products for you to check out. Really, I just kind of pick one at random. Um, and see if it works here's one uh, hit that little listing limitations apply and you'll see that little button underneath it that says request approval and boom selling application approved uh, but this one's for that specific ASIN though it doesn't mean that I am ungated in all the Star Wars brand uh, so we'll try another one and see if I can get ungated in the brand And it's a no-go. So if you did have like the invoices and the letter and all that stuff, go ahead and submit that here. Uh, and maybe you'll get approved for it, but I don't. So we'll go and uh, move on to the next one. I'm just trying trying random brands here. I mean, it, whatever you can think of, just put them in. Uh, this one's Gucci. Let's try it out. Auto-approved. There you go. So it's basically, it's that easy. Um, you're just searching for a brand picking a product, uh, hit that listing limitations apply, uh, and then uh, under that, it's going to say request approval. You see I'm already uh, ungated in Nike. I'm just trying to think of different brands to put in here. So basically, if you see that sell yours button, it, it means, you know, you're, you've got full permission to sell whatever product it is. Um, but if you want to find a list of brands, I basically just go to Google and type in something like um, top brand names or biggest toy brands and things like that. And it gives you a list. So I just go through here one by one and enter that um, brand into here's one. Yeah, here's one that I didn't do. I don't think Bandai. So we'll try that. You see it's listing limitations, hit that, request approval. All right, selling application approved. So that's really all I've been doing is I've been going through here, finding brands, putting that brand into uh, the add a product search page and seeing if it allows me to uh, get auto approved. Some of these um, bigger names I am not able to get, uh, Lego, Fisher-Price, Melissa and Doug, uh, some of these brands that are just restricted, um, 
I don't know if it's restricted to everybody or we really do have to have us invoices and a letter from the manufacturer and all that good stuff. But um, those are still gated to me. Hopefully they'll get ungated at some point soon. But that was for toys. And this is like me searching for electronic brands. So I'll just go into Google, ask for the top electronic brands, run through that list one by one and see if I can get approved for them. And you can do this with pretty much any category that you want to attack. So if it's, um, you know, uh, personal care or health and beauty, then, you know, search the top health and beauty uh, brand names and start putting those into there and seeing if you can get approved for them. You see, uh, Nikon here is not, you're not even able to apply. So... It's saying they're not taking applications at this time, but you can still sell in the used condition. But it's really that easy, guys. I mean, you go to your inventory. Underneath inventory, it's add a product. You throw in a brand into that search box and then see what it comes up with. So I hope this really helped you guys out. Um, like I said, there's no secret sauce to it. Uh, you're not going to get instant approval and in things if you don't have an established history. You will find some, but you won't get the bigger ones. Uh, but just keep working at it. Keep building your business up. And, uh, you know, they'll come eventually. All right, guys, go to your account now and start trying to put in brands and see if you get approved.